Hanwha Interior Film Bodak. Perfect preparation makes a perfect installation. First, prepare ventilator, dust mask, working clothes for safety, gypsum putty, putty knife, sandpaper, sander, brush, and tape measure for preparatory work, rolling cutter, and metal ruler for actual measurement and cutting. Primer, dilutant materials, mixing container, beaker, brush, and plastic sheeting. Squeegee, cutter, felt, and industrial dryer for film attachment. Maintain room temperature 15 to 25 degrees for the best adhesion. Clean the surface and make it flat. And take a measurement considering the direction of pattern. Before starting work, cover the floor or wall with plastic sheeting. This prevents foreign material from staining the floor or wall. Seal all porous surfaces with putty and then dry. Check by hand whether it is dry and then move on. Sand and smooth the surface with sandpaper and clean it with a brush. The strength of the adhesion strongly depends on how flat and smooth the surface is. Use sandpaper for narrow areas and a sander for wider areas to make the surface smooth. The smoother the surface is, the easier the work. Mix the primer with a dilutant at a one-to-one -one ratio and stir. Water-based primer uses water as a dilutant. And oil-based primer uses thinner as a dilutant. For the best adhesion, use the Hanwha OK Primer. Slightly increase the primer ratio during cold weather. Apply the primer evenly on the surface, in line with the grain of the film. For narrow parts and corners, use a small brush. For wider parts, use a big brush or a roller. During the primer application, apply primer two or three times additionally, since the cut side of the wood requires more primer for strong adhesion. Even drawing time depends on the workspace situation. It normally needs more than two hours for water-based primer and more than one hour for oil-based primer. Please make sure to check that it is completely dry. After checking that surface gets dry, make the surface smooth by sandpaper and get rid of foreign materials by brush. Lastly, check the surface condition by hand. The fastest way to our process without any mistake is the accurate cutting and organized adhesion based on measured features. You can use a rubber plate or carpet as a base for cutting and cut with a cutting ruler. Take measurements for each part that the film will be applied on and cut each side about two inches longer than the measurement. Peel off and fold release paper around 4 inches from the edge and temporarily attach the center of the film to align each side. At this time, check whether the film is perfectly aligned and balanced. After that, adhere the film from top to bottom 
in a fan-shaped motion by peeling off the release paper about 10 inches at a time. This work is easier if you do not fold the release paper completely. To finish the attachment, squeeze with a squeegee from the center to the left and right side. At this time, air bubbles could form. In order to release air bubbles, you could apply pressure by pressing a squeegee wrapped in soft cloth at 45 degree angle against the surface. After applying film on a part of the edge first, apply the rest of the sheet along the edge direction and finish clearly extra remaining parts of the applied sheet. The inside corner is the same as well. First apply film to one part of the inside corner and squeeze it to the opposite side. And trim extra film strips with a cutter. In case of low temperature, which makes the film fold hard, you should stick on the surface by heating up the corner side. By the way, please be cautious not to heat up too much time because it could be distorted. At this moment, try to avoid dust. It is recommended that you roll the release paper carefully without making contact with the floor. To stick the central furrow, First, leave a space equivalent to its size and cut off the corner part, then diagonally cut the remaining part. Finally, using the squeegee, stick the horizontal part of the film inside the furrow, and then stick the diagonal piece of film to the corner to finalize the process. When you put the enough pressure, the surface of the processed film would not be separated. So please put every surface of the film with the squeegee. If bubbles rise, make bubbles smaller by squeegee and stick the bubbles with a knife or slit down to release bubbles. In case of overlap and apply case. As some parts of film are overlapped, so joint part does not loosen. Except for some part that will be overlapped, Attach masking film and apply primer on the part to be overlapped. After this work, take off masking film and overlap films and trim the rest parts. In case of overlap and cut and apply case, leaving about two inches release paper, cut each release paper of films that will be overlapped. At this moment, it is very important to cut only release paper. Leaving two inches release paper unremoved, apply second film overlapping first film for about two inches. Use fingers to tack right and left side of product and squeegee the overlapped part. Firstly, apply product on bottom side of curved structure and squeeze up product in an oval shaped motion. Apply to warm product by using industrial dryer along curved surface. 